because I lost the normal commentary I had somehow during the recording, but oh well, at least I was able to see Tyranny's part. And um, basically, if you saw Tyranny's part, this Nuzlocke is halfway over. And I say halfway because he lost, and I win. Sweet! Um, he's going to be continuing Snakewood as normal, and what I'm going to do is continue Snakewood, but with the Nuzlocke rules, I, I want to see how long I can last before I lose everybody. So that should be interesting. I'm still going to be very careful. Um, I don't, I've never beaten this game, so I can at least use what he's doing to get farther in the game, and I've already seen what I have to battle in the future, and it's going to be insanely hard, and I probably won't last more than two episodes. But rest assured, I do last this episode for a little spoiler. Um, and right now we're being chased by stupid Glyce. Stupid Glyce, go away. We don't need you. Die already. And we get teleported to our house. We're at our house, what? But why was there question marks? That makes no sense. Hmm. GameCube. Nah, let's go out. Hey, it's our mom. Let's talk to our mom. And uh, apparently our brother is getting married to May. That's not awkward at all. Okay, our mom is somehow glazed. Oh, that's so creepy. You never know who your mom really is until she transforms into someone else. And when you walk out here, you can just basically talk, into, talk to anybody, and they're basically... It's the same thing happens, they transform into Glyce, and yeah. So we get teleport, teleported here to Necropolis. Um, we're gonna have a battle up here. Um, you're supposed to lose in this battle, because he's got two level 100 Pokemon. But you're about to see what I do here. Uh, the Pokemon he has isn't, aren't really that hard... Like, you can pretty much destroy them no matter... If you have the camera, you're set, basically. So he sends out, uh, Grim Reaper. Yeah, I can pretty much pwn this with, uh, being level 20 levels lower than this thing. Data stream. I don't think that killed it. Nope. And he's gonna spam full restore. Great. So let's just discharge it. Yes. Yes. And we paralyzed him. Awesome. And we took down a level 100. Sweet. Yeah, I basically do beat this guy. Even though with his level 100s. Um, what Tyranny did, I remember he healed his Pokemon after this part just because, um, you're not supposed to win. Um, I don't. Just because I said, uh, whoops. <laughs> yep, I just basically said whoops and didn't care. Uh, I didn't really need to heal anyways. I don't lose that much HP. And okay, we didn't really lose that much, uh. Yeah, Hag is basically going to pwn this stupid Gorlax. We do lose quite a bit of HP, but not too much. I'm basically using here Skullbreaker. We get a lucky crit, and we kill it, and we take down this dude to the hundreds. And we're here at Pacifilog Town. Alright, and in this part, uh, I do increase the volume, just because I thought it was getting a little too quiet. Probably not the best idea. Hopefully my co-com is louder. But anyways, more dialogue. Yeah, I'm basically speeding through the dialogue, I don't really care. I want to get into some of the action. And the dude flies away. Sweet. Okay, so there's two things we have to do first. First, you have to go into this little house here, or hut, whatever you want to call it. Talk to this little girl, and she gives you a chikua. Alright, we got ourselves a chikua. And we basically have to fly to, uh, Lily Cove City, I believe. Prove me right game. Prove me right game. Yep, Lily Cove City. And then you have to talk to this chef over here. And basically you have to do this if you want to verse the gym leader. And of course you want to verse the gym leader, so buy some red stew. We have a crap load of money. We're rich. I wish I was that rich. Almost have a million dollars. Alright, so now we're back to Pacific Law Town. Alright, let's...
let's see. We got to the server over here, and we have to go into that little cave thing right there. Um, let's see, I'm just gonna switch my pokes around, uh... Trying to remember who- I actually trying to remember, uh, what the first Pokemon of the first person that you fight in this place is. Um, and I do remember it being a Magneton, and since I have, uh, Skullbreaker, why not? So I'm just gonna leave the commentary at that. I win, which makes me happy, so I'll see you guys in the next one.